Core verse number five, Leviticus 11, verse 45. Hey, that's kind of a big deal. We're now in the second book of the Bible, Leviticus 11, verse 45. It's two simple sentences. The first sentence is this, for I am the Lord, we're doing a lot of pointing, right? For I am the Lord who brought you up out of Egypt to be your God. So Lord, God, Lord, God. What did he do? He brought you up out of Egypt. Why? To be your God. For I am the Lord, 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 for I am the Lord who brought you up out of Egypt, 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 who brought you up out of Egypt. Say it until you can't hear it or think it in any other way. Who brought you up out of Egypt? For I am the Lord who brought you up out of Egypt to be your God. For I am the Lord who brought you up out of Egypt to be your God. For I am the Lord who brought you up out of Egypt to be your God. For I am the Lord who brought you up out of Egypt to be your God. That's sentence number one. What's the reference? Leviticus 11.45. Leviticus 11.45. For I am the Lord who brought you up out of Egypt to be your God. Now, why is he telling you this? Here's sentence number two. You shall therefore be holy, for I am holy. Again, this is my halo for holiness. You shall therefore be holy, for I am holy. You shall therefore be holy, for I am holy. You therefore, or sorry, you shall therefore be holy, for I am holy. You shall therefore be holy, for I am holy. You shall therefore be holy, for I am holy. You shall therefore be holy, for I am holy. Got it? Let's put the two pieces together. For I, for I am the Lord who brought you up out of Egypt. Did you hear me stumble a little bit? That's perfectly natural. You get the second phrase down, the first phrase, you kind of have to review a little bit. For I am the Lord who brought you up out of Egypt to be your God. You shall therefore be holy, for I am holy. Leviticus 11, verse 45. Let's do it again. Leviticus 11, verse 45. For I am the Lord who brought you up out of Egypt to be your God. You shall therefore be holy, for I am holy. Leviticus 11, verse 45.